Bordeaux welcome Evy on in a dress rehearsal for Friday's French Cup final without the suspended Benoit Tremolina and Julien Faubert. Pascal Dupraz gives Johan Durand his first starting goal for Evian. Evian kick us off. They've won their last three matches in all competitions without conceding a goal. Good pace and power from Biogo Poco. Now he's picked out Diabate. Diabate one on one with Durand and he's gone down. That has to be a penalty. Oh, did he play for it? Diabati to take it himself, and that's a coolly taken penalty. No mistake from the Mali striker. Bordeaux have yet to lose a game this season in which Diabati scored. Now he has a chance to grab another, well round the goalkeeper, and he's made it to an eighth goal of the season for Diabati. Well taken finish. Here's Sagbo. Long ball into the box. Barbosa's on side, but he can't get there. Cedric Carso. Well, is this going to be a penalty at the other end? Yes, it is. Just a yellow card for the goalkeeper. Sagbo now with the chance to reduce the deficit. And how has he done so? Cooley taking penalty. His sixth of the campaign. Evian's 100th league on goal, incidentally, since their promotion to the top division back in 2011. Carrasso's still complaining about it. Two one Bordeaux at half time. Francois Gillot's men remain on course for their eighth consecutive top seven finish. If it stays like this, they'll have the psychological edge ahead of the cup final on Friday, too. Here's Trori. Oh, wonderful flick through from West Belay and Diabati has a chance to make it to a hat trick and it's off the bar. Well, his blushes have been saved by the offside flag anyway. Morris Belay free on the near side. It's a tasty looking ball in, Henri Saive. Well, he should really have done better from that range. Throw and taken by Daniel Vass. That will be the last act of the game. It's ended 2-1 to Bordeaux then. If they can repeat that on Friday. They'll be the French Cup champions for the first time since 1987.